Hi guys, Ben from Busy Loans. Just wanted to share some information in relation to the 150K uh, stimulus package asset write-off for business. A couple of things to note. The asset write-off has been extended from 30K to 150K uh, as per the government. It also has been extended from June 30 to December 31st, 2020. So that allows businesses a bit more time after the recovery from COVID um, to get their ducks in order and, and look at what they're doing in the next 12 months in terms of asset purchases. So what is it? How does it work? Normally when you buy an asset for business use, so for generating income for the business, whether it be a car, truck, types, all types of equipment, even IT stuff, all those types of things, uh, you would depreciate those assets on your tax on a yearly basis, incrementally each year. So what this allows you to do is to write that asset off 100% in the first year as opposed to incrementally over a number of years. What that means is, uh, say for example, if you your taxable income for the full financial year was uh, say 200K for the year, that asset write-off allows your taxable income to be reduced and in turn saves you money in the fact that you don't pay as much tax as you would have in that financial year. So it works well for businesses that are looking at updating their fleets um, of vehicles, also that are looking at uh, asset purchases uh, within the next 12 months that maybe might wanna bring the, that forward to take advantage of uh, these benefits. Just my personal take on this asset write-off though, guys, make sure that this is in your 12 to 24 month plan with regards to any equipment purchases. It's not designed for impromptu purchases or purchases that aren't needed, just for the sake of uh, getting access to this package. So speak to your accountant, feel free to speak to us in relation to any, any questions that you may have, um, but that's basically how it works. Thanks guys.